Screen Team Media. Hi, I'm Ratai. Um, I'm from Dallas, Texas, and I'm on Adam's team. Um, well, when I was three, um, I sang in church. My mom signed me up for this like church performance kind of thing, and I sang, and they were all shocked by the fact that you know something coherent came out of a three-year-old's mouth. <laughs> And so um, my mom put me in voice lessons. Um, it's funny because she's tone deaf. She put me in voice lessons when I was five, and I've been singing ever since. So it's been pretty cool. I watched The Voice last season, and I loved it. Um, it was it was just so awesome to watch, and I think um, that's what made me want to be a part of it because it's such a loving atmosphere. It's such a positive atmosphere. It's about the voice. It's not really about drama or you know what's what's most like crazy the craziest story or whatever who's prettier competition you know it's it's about the voice it's about loving each other and doing this because we love it and it's so positive and that's honestly why I, I decided to do it so blind audition was seriously one of the weirdest experiences of my life <laughs> just because I always get nerves um, before a performance but I wasn't nervous on stage I I really was not nervous at all, and Adam even noted that. He, he was like, um, you're the first person to show no nerves at all. In this whole performance, you had no nerves. And I really didn't, not because I'm so confident, because that's not true, you know, but it was because it, was because it wasn't real to me. I was like, there's no way they, there can be like Adam Levine, CeeLo, Christina Aguilera, Blake Shelton. They're not, like, this is not happening, you know? So I was like, you know, I don't really, I, I felt like I was in a dream. So I wasn't nervous. It was crazy.